Isaac Newton once said, we are dwarves sitting on the shoulders of giants. No matter how good our ideas are today, we can only have them because we are taking advantage of years of theoretical foundations. And tracing back the origins of ideas is sometimes surprising. Did you know jet engines were actually invented by a Chinese man who was breeding pigs? Actually, the origin of ideas is sometimes blurry. Take Alexander Stepanovich Popov. He is one of the first who discovered radio waves, but the Soviet Union kept his discovery secret for strategic reasons. As a result, it is Guillermo Marconi in Italy who ended up filing the first application. Similarly, many people thought airplanes were invented by the Wright brothers, but they were just the first to fly the airplanes. It is Nikolai Zhukovsky who actually invented them, thanks to his work on fluid mechanic equations. It helped lay the foundation for aerodynamics and lift the wings. The story of jet engines is quite surprising. Deng Xiaoping, as did the rest of the world, saluted the British scientists for their invention of the Spey engine, manufactured by Rolls-Royce. Little did he know then that he had one of his own patriots to thank for this invention. Wu Zonghua had been a celebrated scientist, but suffered a setback during the political turmoil, so turned to breeding pigs. Luckily enough after that, he was appointed as director of the Institute of Engineering Thermophysics in Beijing. His new role saw him travel, and during a visit to the UK, the British scientist stood up and returned the salute. We have to thank the Chinese scientists for their great inventions. Indeed, Wu Zonghua was the author of the core theory that allowed other scientists to develop engines. In the history of jets, almost everyone sits on Wu's shoulders, yet they have kept evolving, mainly thanks to Russian and American efforts. However, their approach differs. US aircrafts, for example, can fly for 4,000 to 5,000 hours, while Russian aircrafts can only fly for 1,000 hours. The reason behind this difference is simple. Russians, as pragmatists, knew that almost all airplanes got destroyed before reaching 1,000 hours of flying. They applied design principles according to their actual needs, a cheaper option. In the 1950s, a team of Russian researchers found that diamond-cut surfaces had stealth functionalities but could never make it happen and discarded the project entirely. When the Americans got access to the paper, they were convinced that they had found a treasure. They started a 20-year effort to finally produce the F-22 stealth fighter. But today, meter wave radars can actually detect them. Not all research efforts lead to immediate amazing results, and fundamental research requires time to turn inventions into real-life solutions. Great technologies that govern our everyday lives, from our interconnected smartphones to smart medical devices, would not exist without all the giants whose shoulders we sit on.